Dear learners, congratulations to you on behalf of Borura Virtual School Kumila. Okay learners, I am your Rafi Amem with you from Chapina of Gond and please know me, everything is okay or not. Can you hear me? And if everything is okay, then share this video with your friends. Okay learners, now you can gauge ma'am. We do not know you. We cannot know you because we cannot see you. Okay, here you see, this is about cat. And here you see, this is like cats. And I can remove this cat if you stay with me in this class from the first to last. Then I can remove this cat. I can remove the gauge of cat. So dear learners, if you stay with me in this class, I can remove this. Okay. So at first tell me, you will stay with me from first to last. And then can you gauge actually what may be our today's topic, what I have told you? You have to understand the topic on the base of my sentences. I have told you I will remove this cat if you stay with me in this class from the very first to last. Okay. Okay dear students. So can you tell me actually what may be our today's topic? Yes. Our today's topic is about conditional sentence. Okay. Our today's topic is about conditional sentence. How? Actually, I have given you a condition. I will remove this cat from my face if you stay with me from this class from the very first to last. So, our today's topic is about conditional sentence. In your term uh, completing sentence you will get this item conditional sentence and actually this is the class for the students of 19 okay so learners uh, if you have any problem please know me by comment actually what is conditional sentence when we see any condition in anywhere then this is conditional I have given you a, a condition and condition is that you have to stay with us stay with me from the very first to last of our class and actually this is condition and you know there are uh, mainly three types of condition first condition second condition and third condition and today we will discuss about first conditional sentence and at first I will give you a very easy example like if you come Okay, I am writing first condition. If you come, then what may be the another part? If you come, if you come to me, then you can say, I will present you a garland. Okay. One can say, ma'am, if you come, I will present you a garland. And again, another can say, ma'am, if you come, I will present you a car. Wow. If you want to get this car, so come here. Actually, these are condition. Okay. So... I am telling you, if you come, I will present you a car. Okay, dear students. So, look at here. If you come, this is very present tense. Simple present. If you come, this is simple present. Then, I am telling you. Actually, I am telling you, if you come, 
I will present you this card. So the first one, this sentence is very present. I am telling you, if you come, that means this is simple present. And then I am telling you, I will present. You will come to me at future. You cannot come me at this moment. You cannot come to me at this moment. Of course, you will come to me in future it may be after one hour or after one day or after one year of course it will be in future so i am saying you i will give you i will present you this card i cannot tell i am presenting you because you are not present here you are absent from here so i cannot tell if you come i am presenting or i present so what I have to tell? I have to tell that if you come, I will give you, I will present you this card. Okay. So what is the structure of the sentence? Structure is that if the first condition, if the first sentence is in simple present tense or present indefinite tense, then the another part will be in simple future if this is for simple present then another will be in simple future as this is for present indefinite it will be for present sorry uh, future indefinite okay so here you see this is the symbol of future indefinite will and after will we use the verb in present form Okay learners, have you understood it? And in today's class, actually I will take your class just for first conditional sentence. This is for just first conditional sentence. That means with simple present, we will use simple future. So dear learners, can you understand me? Please tell me and I will give you more and more example with practical instrument so that you cannot never forget this class. Okay, learners, I want to check everything is okay or not. Media Shandukok is with us. Okay, Media Shandukok, Walaikum Ashalam. M. Morshid Pail, sir, is telling you how. Thank you so much, sir. Okay, we see Jeshmi Islam is with us also. Okay, learners, then I will give you more and more examples. And you know, we have only 25 minutes. So, we cannot. get more and more time and uh, i am uh, showing you the examples with practical instrument okay then actually uh, i will not write down all the sentences because i will not get more and more time so what can i tell okay look at me look at me very carefully what can you see here you can see here some fruits so you can get if you eat the fresh fruits regularly, what will be the answer? Here, first one, the first part is if you eat. If you eat these fresh fruits regularly, so what may happen in another part? Who can tell me? Yes, I am telling you uh, something and of course you will respond me by comment. Okay, so first one is if you eat, if you eat this, these fresh fruits regularly, you will be strong. Okay, I'm telling you, you will be strong. And you can also tell me, ma'am, if you eat the fresh fruits, you can be healthy. Of course, you can give me this answer in another way. And again, another student can tell me, ma'am, if you eat these fresh fruits, you will be free from diseases. Okay, this is also correct. So, what we can tell? Okay, you can tell as your choice and you can respond to me by comment. Actually, what may be the another new and new and new answer? If you eat these fresh fruits, you can get, you will get all the vitamins. 
again uh, we can say if you eat malta regularly then you can you will get vitamin c a lot okay like this way we can tell more and more sentences with one target sentence and target sentence is if you eat these fresh fruits you will be healthy you will be strong you will be free from diseases you will get vitamins like this way you can explain your answer okay and you can tell me more and more more answer okay learners have you understood it if you can understand please respond to me by comment and if you have any problem you can also respond to me okay ओके मेरे शब्द रूप की टेलिंग आमादेर कंडीशनल सेंटेंस ना है ओके विथ कंप्लीटिंग सेंटेंस ऑफ व्हेन यू गेट कंप्लीटिंग सेंटेंस देन यू गेट अमंग फाइव कंप्लीटिंग सेंटेंसेस यू गेट एटलिस्ट वन कंडीशनल सेंटेंस ओके एक्चुअली कंडीशनल सेंटेंस इज आल्सो अ पार्ट ऑफ कंप्लीटिंग सेंटेंस ओके लर्नर्स � I want to tell you another example and example is that if I have money or you can say if I have more money or if I win a lottery, you can also say here, then what will be the answer in another part? Who can tell me? Okay, I'm telling you, if I have money or if I win the money on lottery, then I will buy a car okay and what you will do you will tell me okay if I have money or if I get or if I win a lottery I will buy a car okay and if at present I have money then in future it may be uh, after one hour or after one day I will buy a car. Okay, learners, I am telling this example. Okay, and you will tell me the another example. Who can tell me the another example? Okay, who can tell me? Please tell me the another example. If I have money, you can also tell me, ma'am, I will help the poor. Okay, you can help the poor. And if I have money, I will make a billing. What do you want to do? You can respond to me by comment, okay? Then I have to tell you another example. Okay, learners? Okay, look at me. Actually, this is about tortoise, and you know the story of hare and tortoise. And you know, tortoise is very slow and steady. And what we have learned from this story, we have learned from the story, slow and steady wins the race. So here I can tell you, if you become slow and steady, then next part will be you can win the race you will win the race okay you can also use here will or you can also use here can or sometimes you can use here me when you will see some possibility in some fire then you can use me also you may win the race okay learners have you understood it 
actually we do not have enough time so we cannot uh, write down all the sentences just i am showing you the examples uh, with practical instrument so that you can never forget these examples okay so learners please uh, please share this video with your friends so that our different can enjoy your cl our class okay then i can tell you another example and this is for okay what is this actually this is about words and if you if you uh, drive this horse or if you uh, ride on this horse then you can go very swiftly okay you can go very swiftly so what will be if you ride a horse you can go very swiftly like this way you can go very fast you can go very swiftly okay learners so if you ride on horse you can go very fast you will go very fast okay you can say actually uh, your examples like this way and again i am showing you i am telling one other sentence if you have a gun with you okay if you have a gun with you then you can protect yourself you will be able to protect yourself one can tell you will be able to kill your enemy okay so how we can tell our answer please try to give me the creative answer from your mind okay okay learners actually i want to see if you have any problem or any query or not media center book is telling nice presentation show now it is telling this is car okay okay learners please please response me by comment okay dear learners at first you have seen these fresh fruits and we have told you if you eat these fresh fresh fruits then you will be healthy or you will be strong and i am giving you the example again very opposite example okay look at me what may be our opposite example opposite example is that okay learners again look at me here you see all these things are fruits also but these things are not the real fruits okay at first you have seen the real fruits but uh, suppose uh, these fruits have formalin and uh, they have got rotten so if you eat these fruits what may be your effect if you eat these rotten fruits you will be sick you will lose your strength okay you will be sick you will lose your strength okay learners like this way you can tell me the what may be the another new and new and new answer please try to tell me and please try to respond to me by comment okay actually i am showing you the real year that means the real instrument so that we can never forget this class we can never forget the idea when you will try conditional sentence then you will think actually you can give many many new answer but it will it uh, would be logical okay okay learners again look at me
Okay, I can say you if you make a good result in the examination. If in your examination you make a good result, then what may be the another part? Another part may be if you make a good result, you can say I will gift or I will present you a garland. You can also tell if you make a good result, I will present you a motorbike or a scooty or you can say if you make a good result in your examination i will gift you a bicycle okay okay learners okay dear learners then i want to tell you another example if you want to go anywhere very swiftly then what may be the another part yes you can also share another part is that you will use plane you have to go on plane okay if you want to go anywhere very swiftly then you have to help you have to take the help of plane so you can use you will use plane so dear learners again i am showing you or i am telling you another example so look at me okay suppose uh, here these are two vehicles and the last vehicles on to wants to overtake this vehicle so uh, here our first part of the sentence is if you want to overtake then you can say you will give a signal okay if you want to overtake then you will give a signal and after giving the signal you can own you can overtake okay so what is our first part first part is if you want to overtake then you will give a signal okay learners okay learners again i am uh, showing you another example and this example is that if i have two birds if i have two birds first part is if i have two birds then what will be the next part next part is that i will give you one bird okay i will give you this bird so first part is if i have two birds then i will present you one bird okay learners so dear learners like this way actually we can complete our conditional sentence and uh, actually uh, we have to finish our class within two minutes so if we have any problem you can tell me Please tell me about your problem. Okay, maybe I should be studying couple. Okay, couple bird. Thank you so much. Um, jo by that sir, ma'am is telling nice. Okay, nice. Class board, virtual school, Pumila. Okay, nice presentation. Okay, teaching through the use of materials is becoming extremely excellent. Thanks a lot. Thank you so much, sir. Rumba Das is telling so nice class. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, learners. And last one, actually, I want to tell you for writing conditional sentence. You will uh, remember, you will keep it in mind that you can complete your conditional sentence in various ways. But you should be logical 
you can tell me if you come i will present you a car you can tell i will present you a plane you can tell i will present you a garland you can also tell if you come i will uh, beat you you can also tell i will kill you you so do not tell this but you can tell okay like this way you will complete your uh and sorry you can tell uh, if you come i will uh, be i will be very pleased you can tell also this so i am telling you that you can complete the answer as your choice but it should be logical okay learners here actually we are concluding our class and see you again in our next class uh, with part 2 conditional sentence part 2 Okay dear learners so wish you all the best bye mm-hmm.